mission when you started the Container Store back in 1978 was to create the best retail store ever. How have you translated that into your new venture, Treehouse, for sustainable products for the home? Well, fortunately, I'm working with a group of people, Jason Ballard and his team, that want to do that anyway. So we're working on you know, creating the value. We have the values and running our business by those values and being diligent about every single part of our business, every single detail matters, to work on the store presentation, to work on our product training, to work on growing the merchandise collection, all the things you do that to makes a great, great retail store. You don't just appeal to the, the, the green, sustainable people. You, you approach them, but you also approach people who are concerned about health of products in their home. You approach people who really just want high performance, good looking products for the home, and they want it in an environment that's fun and easy to shop in, where people are knowledgeable and helpful. So we're, we're, we're learning how to better address the market. At Treehouse has associates on the floor who have the most education possible for this space. That would go also for healthy products and energy efficient products. They know about the entire spectrum of green. Right, you have to know the, 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 the chemical content of, of, uh, of products. You have to understand how they are installed because you have to make sure you're talking to customers about something that's reasonable for what their, their, their own home situation is. So you have to look at every single aspect of it and know products in a way that convinces customers. Because the customers, they're not going to spend the time to research the product. They just have to trust you. And to trust you, you have to know what you're talking about. What would be the main lesson you would share with entrepreneurs who have a vision for something really big and something that, based on the experience you had at the container store? Well, the first thing is don't have a vision really big. Start off, start off thinking small, because if you think big, you're going to walk off the cliff. You're going to make, you think big, you make big mistakes early on. You have to make mistakes, but those, those mistakes can be fatal if you're thinking big. If you can just start with the money you can get, get, gather together and look at your business in detail, begin on a modest scale, and then grow the business. Well, that sounds like a model for developing a really sustainable business. So thank you for sharing.